Hello everyone, I am Bendy7195, and today, I am making another Drake and Josh video, and it's about Drake and Josh's aspect ratio, as you saw from the title and thumbnail. Spherical! Okay, so let me get this out of the way real quick. Season 1 was shot with a 4x3 standard definition camera that was used for the Amanda Show, all that, and Keenan and Kel. But for seasons 2, 3, and 4, those seasons used a high definition 16x9 camera. Spherical! So seasons 2 and 3 were, like I said, shot with a HD 16x9 camera, but they are pretty impossible to find in widescreen. So let me show you a blooper from Drake and Josh that was featured in Sam and Cat. You won the scoring game! <laughs> that didn't make any sense, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yay! Now, let me play the scene that this blooper originates from. You scored the winning touchdown! Really? <laughs> Wait, uh, but, but I thought that guy from Lincoln tackled me. He did, but he hit you so hard that he actually knocked you 20 yards into the end zone. You won the game! Now, if you were to overlay these, you would notice that they don't line up. And that is because of a little technique called pan and scan. Now, if you don't know what pan and scan means, it's a technique for narrowing the aspect ratio of a widescreen movie to fit the squarer shape of a television screen by continuously selecting the portion of the original picture with the most significance, rather than just the middle portion. And if we take that logic for that Drake and Josh blooper, and the scene that that blooper originates from, that would make sense. As, like I already said, the picture just doesn't line up between the two. So that would mean that any time any widescreen clips from season 2 and 3 of Drake and Josh have ever been shown, they had to manually find the original raw footage and re-edit it so that it syncs to the episode. But for season four, that's a different story. Spherical! So, while seasons two and three used a pan and scan technique, season four did something different. While it was still filmed with a 16x9 camera, it used a different technique. And that is, they filmed it as if they were filming it in 4x3, similarly to what shows after it did, an example being iCarly. But unlike iCarly, the edits aren't necessarily the most well put together things, as sometimes you can see these black lines on the left and right side of the screen appear, probably the pan and scan technique. <laughs> Unless someone were to go for all 31 episodes, dig out the raw footage, resync it to the original episode, add in arrow transitions, re-edit all the introductions and seasons free intro, I don't think that will ever happen, unfortunately. I'm sure if Nickelodeon wanted to publicly release the rest of season 4's episodes, in widescreen, I'm sure they could, but as for seasons 2 and 3, I don't see those seasons ever being released in widescreen, 